This is Wilson Morales from BlackFemale.com talking to actor Kadeem Hardison who's here at the San Diego Comic Con 2012 to talk about his latest project. What are you here for? I am here because I am in a game. I am in a game that's produced by Quantic Dream, who produced Heavy Rain, and this game is called Beyond Two Souls. Now, what's the story about? What's the game about? <laughs> I can't tell you nothing. That's all I can tell And Ellen Page is, is in it, and uh, I got to work with her, and, and she was fabulous, and Eric Winter. How did you get involved with it? Uh, I'm a gamer, and uh, I think by I think the casting lady, David had a list of 10 actors that he wanted to see. The casting lady had given him, you know, he was like, yeah, looking at faces, looking at resumes. He said, bring in these 10. And I was on the list, so I got to meet him. And when I went in to meet him, for about 40 minutes, uh, there was no script, no audition, no, no, nothing for me to really do other than talk to him and hopefully make an impression that would have him go back to Paris and then while he was writing this script for the next eight months, think of me. So I just, I just, uh, I complimented his game over and over because I, I just finished playing his first, well not his first game, but uh, his last game. Uh -huh. and, uh, and I was a big fan of it, me and my kid, we played it, we loved it. So I pretty much for 20, 45 minutes just told him how much I loved his game. And, uh, and then he went home. And then eight months later, I got a call saying, you're in it. What? That's great. So, now, is this your first time in San Diego Comic-Con? Yeah. I, I, I wanted to come every year for the last four years, but I wanted to come with something. I didn't want to just come and hang out. Next year, now that I've been, I'll get a Batman, I'll get my, Bat my Dark Knight mask, and I'll just roll in and just be one of the geeks. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. but for, for, the, for uh, my first time, I wanted to come with something to say. You know, I'm here doing blah, blah, blah. Okay. So, so now, you just recently directed a film that was shown at the American Black Film Festival. You know, what's that story about? And are we going to make it, is it going to be in theaters? We hope so. So that was the, the whole thing with getting it in the film festival was seeing the response and seeing where we should go. Video, straight to video, you know, DVD, how, what's the next plan? So we're still working on that. But, um... That's the story of two guys, two best friends, one guy who always gets the girl, one guy who never gets the girl, and uh, they're both frustrated with the state of love. Because one guy can always get the girl, he's frustrated, because one guy can never get the girl, he's frustrated, and they hatch a party, and they hatch an idea to have a party where you meet under different circumstances, whereas instead of going out and checking out at the club, and you know, screaming over the music, it's a dark party, you're blindfolded, you have to connect on a different level. You have to connect just by talking to them and, you know, smelling them and all of that. The movie is called The Dark Party? Yes, sir. You know, now you've been around, obviously everybody remembers you from a different world. Yeah. You know, what's it been like since the show been off the air? You know, do you still get a lot of love? Yeah. Have you, you know, did you ever think you were pigeonholed? Because we haven't seen a lot of you in TV or in films. Yeah, I don't think, I don't think it was me personally. Personally, pigeonhole. I think black folks kind of got moved to the side in television once a different world went off, Martin kind of went off, and then they kind of got real quiet for us television ones because you know people didn't want to see you know what they thought of as buffoonery, and some people didn't think that we could do drama, and so nothing really exciting was happening. So, uh, so no, it's I don't I don't think it was me personally a pigeonhole. I think the whole us as a whole, we all kind of got you know kind of got shifted. It, 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 there was a shift where it went from it was really popular to uh, not so much. Now you've been in the, in the game, one form or the other. What keeps it grounded when you're not working? Uh, my daughter, I got, I got a 15 year old that I kind of have to make sure she's all right. So, it, it keeps me sane, it keeps me you know, hungry, it keeps me on top of the latest tricks that they're trying. You know, it just kind of keeps you present. So, with this project you're working on, this game, when are we going to see it? Uh, the, the, the hopeful date is probably. 2013 spring. That's what they're shooting for. Alright, so best of luck with everything else. Thank Thanks you, a lot. Thank you. Alright. All right.